Alright, another hairball to add to my collection. A boy and his barfing cat. These are awesome! They're one of the most portable of all the pukes. Having never, ever thrown up myself, I just don't get what's so wonderful about barf. Wonderful? I'll tell you what's wonderful. The long wait is over! The wait for... For bring your kid to work day, of course! It's today! I've got a fun-filled day planned for us at the water facility, Ty. Right. How could we forget? <laughs> and we have a whole day at the university together, Abby. It'll just be you, me, and my insects. Some quality mother-daughter Madagascar hissing cockroach time. Cool. A call to arms, Ty. Are you ready to battle the contaminants that threaten to plague our fair town's drinking water? Battle? You betcha! We're going to be grime fighters, ridding the water of fecal coliform and parasites like Giardia lamblia and the like. Cool! Fecal matter and parasites. <laughs> to grime fighting. <sighs> I guess it runs in the family. Ooh, we better get going too, dear. Isn't it magnificent? Untreated water from the reservoir filled with tons of microorganisms that could make you really... <laughs> See? I told you it was gross. Uh, Dad, that kid just puked in the city's drinking water. That water will be treated thoroughly before it's drinkable. That puke doesn't stand a chance. It starts with flocculation, which removes dirt suspended in water. Alum and other chemicals are added to the water to form tiny, sticky particles which attract the gunk. Making them heavy enough to sink to the bottom. Check! That's called sedimentation. Next comes filtration, which uses... Filters! To remove organic material, like that kid's breakfast. right Oh, Like father, like son. Uh... Gotta take this, uh... Probably Abby, uh, begging for a fecal matter update. I'll try not to chat too long. I got tons of neat stuff to show you. Uh, oh. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> Director, are you all right? You see this? This is a barf bag. I want to know why I'm having to use it. <laughs> <laughs> The whole city is tossing its cookies. It's up to the Bureau of Grossology to get this under control, and that means you agents. Yes, sir. But it's bring your kid to work day. It'll be hard to work without blowing our cover. Now it's bring your barfing kid to work day. <laughs> get on it! <laughs> So the kid's a chip off the old block. <laughs> hmm. Abby, come in. Uh, I'll catch up, okay, Mom? I'll see you in my lab. Hurry, Abby. It's time to feed the insects. Abby. What is it, Ty? There's a pukathon crippling the city. 
Over town are doing the Arfie McBarfie. Hi! Hi! We need to find a way to ditch Mom and Dad. Oh! Did you just slip on a pile of puke? Sorry to disappoint you. Some sort of slime. It leads into or away from the water tanks. <laughs> you think it means anything? I don't know, but it might have something to do with all this puking. I'll get a sample to lab rat. What was that? My stomach. The girl with the stomach of steel has a tummy ache? Do not. Ugh, I'm fine. <sighs> now get that sample to Lab Rat pronto. Ugh. Sure. Talk to you and your widow tummy later. Come have a look. I'm studying the feeding habits of the dung beetle. Cool. Now, I should warn you. Dung beetles eat dung. Feces. Poo. Uh, are you all right, dear? You look nauseous. Nauseous? Me? Never. Not a chip. <coughs> oh, my. Uh, I, I just threw up. But I've never thrown up. Some people are just more sensitive than others, sweetie. It's okay. Dung beetles probably seem quite gross to the average person. Mom, I'm not grossed out by bugs or dung or... You're just a little squeamish. Squeamish? But... No! Mom! Don't speak. <coughs> I'll get you something to make you feel better. Oh. <coughs> Ty? Did you drop something? Uh, just checking for cracks. A sealed floor is a clean floor. Isn't that what you always say? Well, yes, it is. Here, let me help. That's okay, Dad. This is a one-man job. I'll catch up in a bit. Okay. See you soon. Yeah, hmm. That is one gross beach towel. I really want to see this. Abby, check out this towel I found. It's covered in that slime and it's... I can't take it, man. What's that? I can't take it, man. Abby, take your hand off your mouth and spit it out already. <laughs> Did Abby Archer, the gagless grossologist, just puke? <laughs> I'll take that as a yes. Until now, my grossology career is over. I've got the results on that slime analysis. Whoa! Abby, you look awful. Thanks for the news flash, lab rat. Lab rats? I don't have any rats, honey. Good thing, too. It seems that my insects alone are too much for your delicate tummy. Oh, but I don't have a <coughs> delicate tummy. If you say so. I have to go to a meeting. Will you be okay, sweetie? I'll be fine, Mom. Thanks for the tea. How's your delicate tummy, honey? Very funny. Remind me to barf on you later. <coughs> Any news? Yeah. The slime is a combination of sweat, snot, bile, and virulent bacteria. It's a toxic soup. Do you think it's related to our big barfarama? If it got into the city's drinking water, your stomach would send it back. No questions asked. I have questions. Why can't I stop puking? How am I gonna be a grossologist with a weak stomach? Your yak attack is perfectly normal. When you're sick, barfing is actually a good thing. Come again? When the lining of the stomach or small intestine becomes irritated by, uh, bacteria or toxins, the vomit center in the brain is triggered, which signals the stomach to do the backwards bungee. Throwing up is a natural process. You gotta go with the flow. If you don't, it'll come out your nose. Awesome! Yeah, sounds like fun. 
Oh, I just wish I could be more help. It's not your stomach we need right now, Abby. It's your brain. I just thought of something. Our brain! It lives! It can't be the bacteria in the water that made me sick. Why not? Because I've only had bottled water today, or boiled. So, no bacteria. You sure? What else have you had? Hmm. Waffles and orange juice. Bottled water. And now tea. <gasps> the orange juice! It was from Concentrate. Mom made the OJ with tap water. And I didn't have any. And neither did Mom or Dad. So something or someone has contaminated the city's water. What I don't understand is how the bacteria could have gone undetected. Bacteria detection? Well, we constantly monitor water quality. We test for 83 different contaminants. It's a fascinating process, Ty. Yeah, 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 I'll bet. So, is there any way a contaminant could go undetected? Chlorination is very thorough, and we look for all the usual suspects. Let me check our test results. The usual, huh? What about unusual bacteria? Did you find anything? The H2O is A-OK. -okay. Dad's tests seem normal. But lab rats' analysis puts the slime levels off the charts. These toxins are so bizarre, they're not being picked up or neutralized by the standard processes. That's strange. <gasps> the pressure in the water tank seems to be rising and fast! We have to move. If water pressure in the tanks is rising, it's probably because the toxins are mixing and releasing gases. <gasps> I think I'm onto something, Abby. Be right back, Dad. Uh, nature calls. <laughs> Sloppy Joe! Of course! Who else could be filthy enough to overwhelm a plant? Hey, you! What do you think you're doing in there? <laughs> I'm diving for treasure. Scram, kid. Oh, yeah? How about you, Scram? Hit the road, punk, before I wax you. Hey! No. So you want to play dirty, huh? Ooh, there's another way. <laughs> Out of the vat, pal. You've made enough people sick for today. Sick? You want to know what's sick? Ruining your guy's vacation. Vacation? <laughs> okay, all you kids out of the pool. <laughs> okay, what now, boss? Um, go? Go? Sure, kid. I'll go wherever I want. <laughs> Getting a little gross, even for me. Sloppy Joe! He's decided the water facility is a great place for a vile vacation. He's been swimming in the water tanks, the big dirt ball. So his filth is overpowering the plant. Sloppy Joe made me puke! I had him, but he gave me the slip. A really gross kind of slip. You have to get him out of there. How are you feeling, honey? You're saying some odd things. Mom, hi. Uh, better thanks. Just chatting with Ty. Why don't you come to my lecture on moths? They're not as icky as those nasty old dung beetles. It's not the beetles! I mean... I think I'd better rest, okay? 
Okay. Just call me if you need me. Now, where were we? I can tell you where we are. Barf City! The puke problem is out of control! Look! <laughs> <laughs> Joe out of the system. Then maybe Dad can get the plant under control. We need ideas. If we can't force Sloppy Joe out, maybe we can try to lure him away. Uh, what do you do on vacation? I don't know. Read, play games. That's it. A game. Sure. I'll ask Joe to play checkers. No, rock, paper, slime. Joe's a big dumb kid at heart. Something more like... A ball! A big beach ball! It seems to make Mom's dung beetles happy. Where am I gonna get a beach ball? Not just any beach ball. A ball that Joe can't resist. A gross one. Hey, I think I've got it. Guys, don't go! I need your help! Oh! I hope this works. Playing in the muck without a slime suit stinks. La 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 la, rolling my mud ball at the uh. beach. La 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 la, rolling my mud ball. Ooh, 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 ooh. La, 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 Sweet la, mud ball. <laughs> woohoo! Yeah, woo! What fun! I'll just leave my big stinky mud ball here while I tie my shoe. I sure hope nobody takes it. <laughs> he took the bait. Hey, you! That's my mud ball! <laughs> <laughs> so long, kid! <laughs> I got you all! <laughs> Mud ball is one that you take from someone else. <laughs> now how do we stop the plant from blowing and clean up the water? Labrat said that when the body is contaminated, it purges itself. Right. You throw up. The water facility is contaminated the same way as my stomach. So why not make it throw up? Purge the filth and release the pressure. Abby, that's great. Operation Puking Pipes is a go. Ty, your plan is a little unorthodox. It'll work. If the filthy water has somewhere to go, then it won't explode. I don't know, Ty. It sounds pretty risky. What other choice do we have? Okay, son. Let's give it a go. Ready, set, purge! I love making mud men. <laughs> Best vacation ever. Huh? Ah! Clean water? No! It worked! Pressure is back to normal, and the plant is spotless! Yeah! Wow, sparkly Joe. 
Well, hello, fan of the H2O, eh? Can't blame you, fascinating stuff. It's been a bit of a hectic day, but uh, what the heck, let me, no, let me and my son show you around. <laughs> Hello, ladies. How was your day? Not so good. Abby got a sick tummy. I think my dung beetles got to her. <sighs> That's right, honey. Just rest. You've had a tough day. She doesn't know the half of it. <laughs> <laughs> All right! No way! That one's mine. Hey, I'm the puke fan around here. After today, I have a newfound appreciation for the art of barf. Hmm. <laughs>